Welcome everybody to another Wolf Ball Wednesday episode. Today we kick off our night series here in the backyard. In honor of 4th of July, we have the U.S. Constitution versus the Midnight Minutemen. Tonight, I'm looking for a lot of fireworks here at the field, a lot of home runs, a lot of strikeouts. So, for the Constitution, we have Julian Tarzan Lopez. Only 8.1 innings pitch, missed a couple series, the last two ones, but he's just back and ready to play in this night nighttime series. Isaiah Molina on the bump, one of the best pitchers we have this season. Look at that point, uh, .33 ERA, one of the lowest ERAs we've ever seen here in, in our Wolf Ball Wednesday history. Looking for more domination here for him in the backyard. So let's see what these two teams could do here tonight under the lights. So for the Minutemen, they send Jake Relas to lead off, batting 256, Isaiah Molina batting second, batting 321, and Ryan Guan rounding up the lineups, making his Wolf Ball Wednesday debut. Here's Jake in an 0-2 count against Julian. And he strikes out swinging. What a sword by Jake. Cannot keep another strike alive. Been fouling off a bunch of pitches in the bat. Julian has thrown like seven strikes in a row. Now Zay, one two count. And he rolls one over to Julian. That is a one two inning for Julian. Welcome back, Julian. We missed you. For the US Constitution, they send Anthony Padilla, probably my future lawyer, to the plate, batting 250. Second, Julian Lopez. And third, Josh Ikes. Anthony Padilla leads off three home runs this season. 0 2 count. Strikes out swinging, Zay with that nasty singer coming outside the plate, in on Padilla, and racks up his first K of the day. This pitch is the difference maker in his Cy Young season this year. Here's Tarzan, and he pops on the right side, Jake wasn't there, and he makes the catch, running catch, going across the field to retire the side for Isaiah Molina. Here's Ryan's first at bat here. He's in a 3-1 count. And he takes one high. He will be take his base. Now Jake. First pitch coming. And he grounds on over to AP. And that rolls over the bag. And that is fair ball, folks. In disbelief, but it is fair. Now Zay picking on the first pitch again. And he pops one up, but that's carrying center field. And it's over Padilla's head. Tree gets in the way, and that'll be a single for Zay the, over that outfielder's head roll, and that'll be Zay's first hit of the day. First hit between these two teams. Here's Ryan now, second shot, 0-1 count. And he hits one to the right side, but Josh is there. Good contact for Ryan, but nothing to show for it yet. Score 0-0. Zero, zero. Now Josh, bottom of the second, 2-2 two, two count. And he strikes out looking. Zay with that nasty two seam coming back in the zone. Racks up his second K of the day. Here's a sequence, just a bunch of sinkers coming at him. Overwhelms Josh, only looks out at that one. Now Padilla digs in with a two-two count himself. And he strikes out swinging very early on that pitch. Look, makes him look silly right there. Zay got that two seam working, the hard sinker in for one today, folks. Top of the third, no score, 2-0 count to Jake. And he grounds one weekly to the left side. Jake's been a little skid lately, looking to break out of it. Now Zay in 2-1 count. And he grounds one weekly to the left side. And oh, by the way, there's chalk on the field now. So that one looked just fair, it keeps it in play. That'll be the inning. Bottom of the third, Julian up. And he picks on the first pitch, and that is off the wall. Julian doubles in the bottom of the third, looking to walk it off here for the Constitution. He was Constitution looking very strong right now. Good position to win this game. Josh wearing his American hat. Strikes out swinging. The other sinker right down the middle, but that is still unhittable. Zay working the count, working the edges this at bat. Get some swinging. Now Padilla's final hope. 2-2 two, two count. 
and he swings. That is a swing. He broke the plane, and that'll be the ending. Well, it looks like we gotta have extras in our first night game here. And yes, he did. Yes, he did. So here, extra innings, runner at third base. Ryan, one, two count, and he whiffs. What a pitch by Julian. Looks like a change of fading away. Always got that in his back pocket. Ryan trying to get his first hit, but such a slow pitch because it gets out in front of that one. Here's Jake, 2-0 count. And another grounder, and Padilla's positioned perfectly. Hard hit ball, but no runs come across. It will go to the bottom of the fourth for the U.S. Constitution. Julian up, 1-2 count. And he swings, very late swing, trying to protect, thinking that ball would swerve back in the zone, but very far strike for Julian to get. Now we have first out. Josh digs in now, winning the first pitch, and he cracks one down the line, and that is game. Josh wins it for the Constitution, a 1-0 ball game, and they rush the field to celebrate. Josh in his last series got his first hit, his first home run, and now he hits a walk-off single under the lights. This guy is built for the moment. One of the most improved players from last season, he gives the win for the U.S. Constitution. Game is 1-0, decided by four innings. Zay going 3.1 innings, could not get the last out. Julian going four strong innings with two Ks getting the win. Welcome back, Julian. It's good to have him back. Wolf ball is not the same without him. And that is the game. Thank you folks for watching. A very exciting game. Looking for more excitement for the other games to come. Thank you.